Hi, my name is Kevin O'Valley, and today I'm going to talk about the most unusual creature I know, the star-nosed mole. Let's use our imagination for a second and pretend we're taking a hike through a muddy, wet terrain in the northeast region of North America, and out of nowhere, this creature, bizarre creature comes out from under the ground with these huge claws and this mouth that looks like an octopus. And from the first sight, you're, you think, is this from the movie Predator or Alien? And you think it might want to attack you, but it's actually a harmless animal, and its name is the Star-Nosed Mole. I gave that background so you can have an idea of the type of terrain you might find this creature at. In the first look, you, you'll find that it is a bizarre looking creature, but the features I've talked about is only a slight detail in how it searches and looks for food underground. It uses its claw to make tunnels, to find food. Um, it's nearly a blind animal, so it uses these star-shaped organs on its face to search for food underground. And when it looks for food, it touches and it's able to get an idea of the food it wants and it'll decide right there and it'll eat it. It'll send a sense to its brain and it'll eat it. It's also, I, I add that in there because it's the world's fastest eater. So as soon as he knows, it's gone. So with that, there's a researcher named Ken Cantania and his sole purpose is to research bizarre animals. And with his searches, it, he has narrowed it down to one animal he wants to research, and that's the star-nosed mole. So, I thought if he thought it was a bizarre animal, I think it's a pretty bizarre animal myself too. With that, I'm going to describe two things about the star-nosed mole. The features go into a little more in depth into the features of the animal and the terrain and how he, where he lives, his habitat where he lives and how he searches for food. With this weird look, so like I stated before, he has 22 organs on, that makes a star pattern on his face. He uses these organs to search for food and to feel almost like an echo effect when looking for food. He uses vibrations to find his way through the dark tunnels. Like I stated before also, he has huge claws, which he uses to uh, tunnel its way through different parts of the ground, underground. It uses its fur, well it has fur that is water repellent because he also, since he likes wet land, he searches for food in uh, underground and wet parts of the ground and also near lakes and ponds. It is one of two animals who can smell underwater. With that, I'm going to describe some of the terrain he may, he may find in that. Like I said before, located mostly in the northeast region of North America. He can be found in Quebec, Newfoundland, North Dakota, east of Virginia, west of Virginia, and different parts, and areas with moist soil and um, low drainage. <sighs> so if you find yourself in those locations and you think, hey, there's this creature, I wonder what it is, and it's very odd looking, it's a good chance you may be looking at the star-nosed mole.